Florida's clerks of court and comptrollers provide a wide range of public services that support the court system and county government. Throughout the state, these services have a positive impact on public safety, ensure access to justice, and maintain official records. For a considerable amount of time, Florida's clerks have faced serious challenges with how their court-related services are funded. Over the past five years, clerks have partnered with the legislature on meaningful but incremental changes to fill some of the gaps in their funding structure. These changes are closing in on more stability for clerks' budgets, but the model that funds clerk services and their staff still needs work. Even with the recent improvements, clerk budgets are very close to where they were a decade ago, and a lot has changed in that time. Here's why. The majority of clerk services are paid for by the people who access them through fines, fees, service charges, and court costs. Clerk budgets are still largely dependent on traffic citations, which make up more than a quarter of clerk budgets. And today, traffic citations are down roughly 53% from their peak in 2007. And with revenues from traffic citations fluctuating monthly and annually, and declining during natural disasters, it creates a revenue roller coaster for clerk budgets. What's more, when fines and fees are collected, clerks are only authorized to keep 54%, and the rest, nearly half, is dispersed elsewhere. Over the past decade, costs have gone up dramatically. Meanwhile, the statutory fines and fees that affect clerk revenue do not adjust to those changes, creating an imbalance in how these important services are provided. This year, clerks are supporting the Let's Make It Work 2024 clerk legislative priorities to create a more sustainable, long-term solution by diversifying clerk revenues, further authorizing clerks to retain more of the funds collected for the services they provide supporting staffing needs by providing new mechanisms outside of fines and fees to fund increases in the Florida retirement system for court-related employees, accounting for additional services without a funding source by providing a state reimbursement process for domestic violence services and approved civil indigency cases, providing additional flexibility, allowing clerks to continuously improve court-related technology. For years, clerks of court have had to make do relying on insufficient budgets and unstable revenues. This year, let's do something different. Let's make it work. Support the 2024 Clerk Legislative Priorities. Visit our webpage to learn more.